Hi, my name is Chef Hutchings and this is how to set up fade-ins, fade-outs and volume automation in the web browser version of BandLab. Near the top left of the screen, just above the first track, click on the automation icon. A white line now appears on each track and the volume bar is replaced with a drop-down list. Volume is already selected in the drop-down list. To add a fade in, click on the white line where you want the fade to end to add a white dot. Then click the white line at the beginning of the track to add another white dot. Now drag that dot down until the pop-up message says minus infinity dB. To add a fade out, click on the white line where you want the fade to begin to add a white dot. Click on the white line at the end of the track to add a second white dot. And drag it down until the pop-up says minus infinity dB. To increase the volume of a section of a track, click on the white line at the beginning of where you want to increase the volume. Then just in front of the dot you added, add another white dot. Then add two more dots where you want the increased volume section to end. Now drag the second and third dots to the desired volume level. Now drag the last dot back to the original volume. You can call me anytime. When you click on the automation icon and the drop down list is set to volume, the white line controls the volume of the track. The higher the white line, the higher the volume. The white line starts at whatever volume this volume slider was already set at. Once you add dots to the white line, volume automation is turned on and the volume slider can no longer be used to set the volume of the track. The volume must be set by moving the white line up or down with the white dots. Double click on a white dot to delete it. Right mouse click the track and click on reset automation to turn the volume automation for the track off. Clicking the automation icon so it is not highlighted hides the automation white lines but does not turn off the automation. Notice how the volume on the volume slider for the selected automated track now moves with the volume automation. You can call me anytime. If you've enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.